Hi everyone, Lisa Leanne here again. Um, I was watching YouTube about five minutes ago and I was looking up at more tutorials on how to make things and I'm going to be making these little bottle cap charms that because I've seen that's popular a lot. Um, th I have a regular Coca-Cola one but they're the small ones but the one I was watching a video the first video I watched um, kind of inspired me to make this tutorial. Um, I have the page up. Um, I'm <clears throat> I don't know how to pronounce the username, but it's K um, Kawaii Kawaii Sweet World. And that's I think how you say it. If okay, if you're watching this and I didn't pronounce your screen name right, I am so sorry. But that's her screen name. Um, she, this was how to make cute recycled bottle caps. That's the one that, that's the tutorial that inspired me to make this. Um, I just tried it. I only have one bottle cap, so I didn't know if it was going to work for me. So I tried one right here. It's a regular, ordinary water bottle cap instead. Um... I did this as a test. It worked, but instead of, I'm, of the glue that she was using, um, a polyester kind of glue or something, I don't know. I don't have that, so I'm just using E6000 Super Glue. That's it. And so let's get started. So I already have my little thing cut out that I want. I have no clue what size this is, by the way, but this is the little design I want. It's my name, so I'm just going to put that in the bottle charm, like this. Sorry, not bottle charm. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I did a tutorial on bottle charms. I'm still confused, so bottle cap in the bottle cap. But first, I'm going to take my E6000, and like she, like, um, she said in the tutorial, um, do a thin layer, and I'm trying to open E6000 one-handed. <laughs> smart. Because I don't have a tripod like what you guys use for most of your tutorials. So I'm doing this one-handed. I'm just holding my camera. So, use just a simple thin layer. If mine wants to come out. There it goes. So, thin layer. Crap. Okay, I got my thin layer. Um, it's a little bit thicker than how I wanted it, but it's still good. So I'm going to face it so the Coca-Cola is facing up. So I'm going to put my paper in. And by the way, I just drew this. It's pretty simple. I'm using what she called the drawing technique. But yeah, you're going to press that in slightly. Make sure I want, I want it lined up with the Coca-Cola words. So it shows upside right, no matter how I wear it. So, there I've got that in. So I'm going to let that dry for a little bit. And I'm going to... But when it's done, it should look like this, but only in <laughs> a bottle cap and not a water bottle cap. Because this is my test one. This one was... This technically isn't my first one. This is a water bottle cap charm. <laughs> I have no clue how you would say that, but I did this. It worked. The E6000 does dry clear, as you can see it with the glossy look. It's pretty shiny, but it's still drying. But I'm going to let this set. And basically all I used to color it was just basic crayons. Crazy art crayons. But we'll check up on it in about 30 seconds or so. Okay, so I let this set for a few seconds. Um, wasn't long. It's pretty tacky, so it should hold um, with a second layer. So smart me decided to close it again, but I can open it if I can. Sorry, I don't know if it's winning, but apparently it's not. 
because I'm getting it open now. Okay. So I'm just going to put a second layer down. So I'm going to have to pause this again. So. Okay. Um, sorry I had to pause that again. Again, I don't have a tripod, so I have to do this all by hand, and I can't do this one-handed. But I put my second layer, or the top layer down. As you can see, it kind of magnified it a little bit. Um, just a little bit. I don't know how well it's going to work out, because I don't know if the E6000 will disintegrate the paper. Um, with a few of my bottle charms, this happened. But, here. Um... I'm keeping it at the floor for a reason. But see with my bottle charm, this is one I made a family one. But it has um one of my initials on it. Uh, it's an H, I know that, but the paper kind of got a little bit disintegrated in it. But most the rest of my bottle charms were fun. And these are the rest of my bottle charms. Um I have so, yeah, you can see from my shadow. Um, I have some from different from states: Minnesota, New Mexico, and Arizona. Um, one I bought. I like this one. It's blue topaz. A family one I made. Um, I have one. My brother has one. My mom and my papa have one. And oh, and this was from. Oops. It, this was the first one. I made a tutorial on this one, Starry Night Stars. Um, don't like how the glitter sank. Not a big fan of that, but oh well. But and the other six that I have, my first six bottle charms, right here. If I can see, there's love. There's message in a bottle. This one is music. There's music notes in it. This one I call universe because um the it was all mixed at one point again the glitter all sank but it's i called it universe because the glitter made it look kind of like the universe this one is my love oops this one that fell is love potion it's just pink paint and glue and glitter simple um these ones don't have a name yet except for um, this one and this purple one. This one. <laughs> I, my friends laughed at me because of this, but <laughs> they thought it was still cool and so did I. I didn't fill this up all the way, as you can see. This one is called Grass Potion. There's green glitter in there, green paint, and glue. Um, what did do? This one is the purple one I showed you. This one I made with friends again. They were also laughing at me because I made a love potion, and now this is the opposite of love. This is a hate potion. But, yeah, just a few the bottle charms. Oops. That's not good. Oh, and this one, I have no clue why I made this one. I call this one Hidden Gold, or Gold One. Gold Potion, I don't know. <laughs> Still thinking of names. But, a bunch of empty ones. A few of the ones I made, but... Oh, oops, tripping over stuff. But, the main thing is... See, uh, fudge. See, that's not pretty... That's not good. The paper is being a little bit disintegrated. The color is wearing off a little bit, but... The name's still good. Which I don't understand, because this one is perfectly fine. Why is that one not? I do not get that. Oh, well, I'll figure that out later, but this one. Well, first one and second one were a little bit failed. First one was good, second one's a little fail. But, oops. Yeah. If you want to learn more um, on how to make bottle charm. No, blah. <laughs> Sorry. Bottle cap charms. Or little bottle caps. You can go to hers. Um, I don't. I'm sorry. I do not know how to put a description in yet. But you can go to her page. She does tutorials, as I've seen so far. And she can. You can watch her 
videos on how to make um, more bottle caps. So, Lisa Leanne, signing off. Bye.